Hi, my name is Deborah Hirsch, and I work for the nonprofit organization called B Lab. Uh, we work with a number of initiatives that are focused on sustainable business um, and creating tools for different stakeholders in this space to use uh, to create real standards and metrics uh, around measuring social and environmental performance. Certified B Corporations are companies that have met high social and environmental performance standards. They are transparent mm -hmm. and, um, and meet high accountability standards um, and also a legal standard around building in uh, responsibility and accountability to their stakeholders. So they therefore uh, assemble a team of um, advisors who help them to develop their standards, mm -hmm. um, the social and environmental performance standards part that all certified B corporations meet. It's, mm -hmm. um, it's actually an online rating system. It's called okay. the B Impact uh, Rating System. It's a great tool and um, it's actually governed by an independent board. So okay. that piece that in entrepreneurs said that they needed um, standards in the marketplace that could be putting a stake in the ground around what is socially responsible, what is environmentally responsible, how do we tell whether a, a business is just marketing themselves as green or sustainable versus let's see how they're really doing and actually have a score. So every company that takes the impact assessment and becomes has a formal relationship with us as a certified B Corporation has a scorecard on our website and you can see um, broken into each of the five stakeholder categories how they're doing. They may be doing really well, their, their primary mission may be um, around environmental um, accountability, but they may be weaker on uh, the benefits that they're delivering to their employees. And you can see exactly because mm -hmm. it's transparent and that's a key part of being a uh, part of this community and about putting in front of the media and consumers and investors that this mm -hmm. is this is something that businesses want to do, mm -hmm. um, and this is this is this is a way that others can can follow. As everybody knows, corporate law is written to um, ensure that a company is delivering maximum return to their owners, to their shareholders, right. and so the first step that B Lab took in, in helping companies who had expanded their definition of what their success looked like mm -hmm. to be accountable and to, to deliver value to other stakeholders besides just their ownership and shareholders um, was to build in the actual requirement to be a B corporation is to pass the take the, the rating system, meet a certain threshold, which is 80 points out of 200, which sounds low, but it's actually hard to do. Right. Uh, and the second piece is that you put into your articles of incorporation that you consider your impact on the other stakeholders. So having a third party to look at all of those things is, um, is, is not only uh, beneficial to the community of certified B corporations, but it's going to be an important tool for a state that now has passed benefit corporation legislation to use that tool to analyze, um, to, to verify that a company really is delivering public value. The rating system, which is based around our standards, I mean the standards mm -hmm. are what the rating system is made up of, yeah. is malleable and it evolves. We've actually already uh, moved from one version to a second uh, more improved version which mm -hmm. raises the bar in different areas for companies. One of our other key collaborations is to work with the state governments mm -hmm. who are interested to help incent uh, and reward the businesses in their, that are incorporated in their states to, mm -hmm. to be socially, to practice social and environmental responsibility, to measure it truly mm -hmm. uh, and to eventually not only legally pr help them protect those practices, but eventually provide a, a foundation for future tax breaks mm -hmm. or procurement preferences, other sorts of rewards. I think it's exciting uh, 
uh, and inspiring to see how much change has happened in the last 10 years. Um, what the options are not only for businesses but also for consumers who are really truly interested in understanding the impact of their of their decisions. Um, we are consumers and so much of, of uh, our impact on the world comes down to the consumer choices that we make mm -hmm. or choose not to make. Uh, and yeah. I'd, I'd like to think that we're finally moving in the direction where we're, we're getting smarter and figuring out how different stakeholders can collaborate so that we can catch up to the nightmare, you know, make a, make a dent in the, in the nightmare that we're sort of, you know, realizing we're in right now.